Havana. I bought uh, uh, this uh, spot to water border from AliExpress. And uh, before to buy this, uh, I had another one similar to uh, uh, six uh, MOSFETs. Okay. Unfortunately, when I used that, uh, it uh, bar burned out uh, because of uh, uh, some uh, design issues. So I decided to buy this because many YouTubers uh, uh, suggest to buy this uh, because it's uh, better than others. It has a very high power uh, and uh, nice uh, and clean uh, uh, welding points. So um, I decided to analyze uh, the PCB and uh, I've seen uh, many drawbacks to be solved in order to, to have a more uh, reliable board. So in this video I'm going to show uh, four uh, points to be uh, solved to reach our end. So the first one. So in this slide uh, you see uh, our board, the um, soldering pin uh, I've uh, bought with the two um, electrodes and uh, in general uh, many people use a simple battery because uh, it can deliver uh, be a very high amount of current with a voltage suitable for this board, uh, around 12 uh, volts. So in the fifth step, uh, um, we will fix the voltage of the coupling, because uh, as you can see, um, they provide this uh, uh, um, electrolytic capacitor to be uh, soldered here. But if you solder there, you have this case. When you have uh, a fist shot, uh, the voltage can decrease. So this voltage can decrease as well because it's directly connected to the um, to the ground, and the control circuit can provide uh, a properly um, response to the gate because the voltage is uh, is uh, de decreased. So we need to add uh, this uh, diode here. If you apply this diode, uh, the voltage across the capacitor is uh, decoupled from the uh, first line and you save the, uh, the MOSFET because you can uh, provide the properly uh, driver uh, current as they require. Here you can see the short circuit when you uh, do the uh, when you solder the uh, cop the nickel uh, strip. The voltage, uh, cioè the diode, prevents the uh, capacitor to be discharged along this line. Along this line. Second step: the fly flyback diode. Um, we have. Uh, uh, the line 1 and line 2. The line 1 refers to the uh, um, cables between the battery and the port. The line 2 represents the um, inductor, the inductance between the board and the, uh, the spot pen, spot welder pen. As soon as we uh, close the MOSFET, the, uh, during the transitory, the current uh, flows here. The um, inductance is uh, charged, but uh, when you open this MOSFET, uh, the inductance is still charged. So you have a huge amount of voltage here which can damage uh, all the components connected here. To prevent this uh, over voltage, uh, you have to apply a fast diode. 
uh, Scott K. Diver here with a very high rated uh, with a single pass. I used uh, one model uh, which is capable uh, to deliver uh, 300 amps uh, for a single shot. You can see here uh, when the voltage, uh, when the MOSFET uh, is turned off, the current uh, flowing through the inductance can be uh, discharged to the load passing through the, uh, the diode till uh, the, the inductance is completely uh, discharged. This is a way to prevent the over voltage across uh, the, uh, the MOSFET. In the further phase uh, we will see the freewheeling interval. Namely, uh, when uh, the, every time the MOSFET closes, the current not only flows through the inductance of the line 2 but also through the line 1 so the line 1 is charged as well of course in the other line line 1 should be discharged in some ways how to do it? at the moment uh, the, the um, MOSFETs have the parasitic capacitance but in my opinion it's not enough it's not enough if you think uh, the the energy stored in the inductors goes with the current power 2 so it is a large amount this uh, uh, energy should be uh, transferred, in this case is transferred to the parasitic capacitance during the transitory, when the, the MOSFET is open. Uh, this means that uh, uh, this energy is uh, um, transformed in uh, voltage increment across the MOSFET. If you increase uh, the capacitance with a snubber cap with a low electric series resistance, uh, you increase this uh, uh, parameter in the equation and then uh, you will have, uh, with the same energy, you will have uh, a lower voltage you just apply this capacitance like uh, one uh, uh, micro, microfarad or a full microfarad around this range uh, we don't need uh, fast switching, uh, continuous switching uh, uh, transistor so we can apply this without uh, too much losses. So when uh, this line is is uh, discharged, the current flows through this uh, mesh, this loop, and the capacitance prevents the um, over voltage across the mask. Another big problem. The face of, the, of this man is clear. Uh, this is the current MOSFET driver represented by these uh, uh, two transistors. This resistance, which uh, uh, provides the current pulse at the gate of all the MOSFETs. This is the um, the uh, voltage applied uh, to this network uh, provided by this uh, integrated circuit. Let's go to analyze uh, this, this pulse. The pulse is, uh, has a very nice response. A quick response at the beginning, just uh, after microsegment, which is uh, okay in our opinion, but when uh, you discharge the MOSFET uh, gate capacitance through the resistor obviously you will not have a nice, a very a, a fast uh, a decrease in voltage in the pulse we are around half millisecond 
the mask is a, a bit impressed of this long time. Why? If, you, if we go ahead, we can think during the turn off of the MOSFET, um, we, we work uh, in the linear region for half millisecond. If, if you see in the data sheet the single MOSFET is operating area at 25 degrees, so we will have more than 25. In any case, in the best condition, we will work more than 10 volts and we will have uh, less than 100 ampere of capability for each MOSFET in the linear region for half millisecond. So we are around uh, uh, the maximum limit of the MOSFET and we can uh, destroy the MOSFET. The, the turn off is critical. We need to modify this network. How? Taking off both the transistors, both the resistance, and uh, replacing them uh, with a very good uh, uh, MOSFET driver. The TC4429 is the best choice, in my opinion, because uh, we can deliver more than 6 amps uh, with the turn off with the turn off and turn on around the same time of the turn off turn on of the MOSFETs. And we can uh, reach uh, our goal, uh, normally uh, the maximum single pulse of each MOSFET of around 1200 amps.